to the Avengers game! Woo! Actually, I think this is the multiplayer beta, so I haven't done this one yet, so... Yeah, don't mind me doing some shameless advertising here in a bit. Yep. As you see, there I was. Back to back with the frickin' Incredible Hulk. This is pretty interesting. I haven't played a Marvel game in a long time. Probably the last one I played was maybe... Uh, actually, it was... Yeah, it was maybe this... Actually, yeah, Spider-Man. It was Marvel Spider-Man. Whenever that game came out. But I... You see, I like to think of Spider-Man just being its own brand of games. Because it's kind of like Batman. Like, sure, Batman exists in the thing. But you know what? Who cares? Let's see. Hopefully I get a lot of uh, good stuff here because I'm doing a lot of self-promotions. Got to make sure my the peeps know I'm here. Yeah, that's how you do it. So I'm going to go ahead and play a lot of this because that's what I'm about. Let's see. Here we go. Ooh. I'm going to send that. And let's go let's get my brothers involved on this. I'm pretty sure they know, but I am going to go ahead and send it to them because I like to annoy them. Let me see. Yep. That's how I annoy them. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and... Yeah, I just did the options. This is actually pretty cool. I like this. We're going to go ahead and start playing the beta. I'm going to go ahead and go with normal. Let's get decreased enemy... Not nah, normal. Okay, so here we go. This is going to be interesting. You know that old saying? Never meet your heroes. Yeah, I'm... I'm t well. Okay, so we're in a Quinjet. Oh, Avengers Day. It whoop whoop. Was awesome. Okay, the so Avengers here's the thing. I played I most of these people in different video games, except for Black Widow, because for some reason Black Widow wasn't available in a lot of games. But I played the Iron Man video game along with the. Uh, Tony, check it out. Uh, I, I haven't played a Hulk game since the movie tie-in movie came out. I never played Thor's game, but I played a lot of these characters in Marvel's uh, Ultimate Alliance, the original, back when I was on PS2. And I could have never finished that game. I got to the end, but the end would always freeze, and I could never play the end of the game, which sucks. Oh man, I really thought I was going to be able to play uh, as a uh, as a uh, Thor. Okay. None. Okay, maybe I am going to play a Thor. Yeah, so this is like the first Marvel game. Like, I'm going to tell you guys. I'm not going to lie. Pretty much it's just going to be... Yeah, that's what I thought. Most of these gameplays are about the same. Well, I figured... Yeah, press triangle to perform heavy attack. You know, I thought Thor would have a more exciting heavy attack. At least when you hold it down when you first press it. I probably like Thor a lot better from the... Okay, that's the heavy attack I was thinking of. L2 ain't... Oh, snap! Thor, who are we dealing with here? Now that's what I call yes. Okay, that was actually a lot more fun. They picked today for a reason. Agreed, Bruce. I'm staying with the Chimera until we figure out what's going on. It makes me wonder, like. Like, imagine the strategies right there. You just throw Mjolnir, and you just don't recall him for a long time. And you're like, oh, shit, 
I need Mjolnir. And you just call for him back and hit the guy that you're going for. See, like, I want to try that real quick. Oh, okay. I didn't even recall. I pressed the recall button. It's just whenever you're ready to perform a heavy attack. That's just what you do. Holy snap, okay. Hold on. Okay, hold on. I'm just reading a bunch of my stuff. Okay, press Owen. Heroic Fury? Oh my god! I mean, how has he not wiped out these guys just from the quake itself? That's a really good freaking question. So this is actually pretty uh, basic hack and slash. But I like the idea, like... I'm surprised Square Enix actually made... Oh, okay, I'm not that surprised that Batman games exist. But this is quite... This is like the most basic of hack and slash. I'm enjoying myself right now, though. Whoppa! Okay, you want to be a hardball? There you go. Where are you all coming from? Oh, snap. Am I about to switch into Iron Man? That's going to be pretty awesome, because again, I have not played... Oh, snap. Just got confirmation. A shield convoy was hijacked this morning. I'm playing as Iron Man now. That's pretty Reeves, awesome. Never read. Come on, Tony. Those are important. Does everyone okay. remember how Whatever. awkward Tony used to be with the uh, Repulsor Blaster, the first movie? I always thought whenever he did the Iron Man Repulsor Blaster, it was always so awkward. Because it just didn't like. It looked like he was learning how to use it, but he looked so awkward doing it too. Already on it. Carlton's heading down to the reactor chamber now. I remember you being able to do barrel rolls in frickin' uh, in the original game that you had. Press heroic ability? Unity! Classified shield prototypes. Fury is tracking down the full manifest. How's the cat? Well, tell Fury I really love being shot at with my own weapon. We'll keep you updated, and Goose is fine. Ha! Didn't know you were listening to that part. You think these That's idiots would be incredible. away by now? Yeah, the and then he's got his own. Yeah. There's something else going on here. You know, it's kind of funny because I remember the Iron Man video game. You could do all this stuff, but you could also like activate your thrusters and just take off, circle around, let your shields get back up. And just take off again. Oh, like that! <laughs> I figured it out. All right, whose bright idea was it to outfit shield trucks with turrets? Tony. All oh, right, mine. Wait, I am in combat. Can't this game even see what I'm trying to do here? And that's all that? Okay. I like how it's like the, his heavy attack is just, let's do a repulsor. Not even a repulsor blast. What's going on down there, Tony? Oh, nothing. Everything's just peachy. Just hoping these guys don't have. Oh, yep, oh, here we go. They take it back. They got, they the, got pulsar the pulsar tank. tank. They got the pulsar tank. Oh, there we go. Cap, that ship's not ready for flight. Why is it moving? How did they not drop Someone's the Hulk yet? The security protocols. The Chimera's autopilot has taken over. You'll need backup. We're heading back. Negative. Secure the bridge. Those weapons can't get in. I remember the city. when the beta came out and everyone's kind of all freaking out, like how different the characters look honestly it looks like natasha looks a whole lot better in the beta than he does in the than she does in the uh the trailers hulk looked like the coolest so did iron man but that's just because you can't really screw them up so much yeah, yeah, yeah. 
This looks like the Hulk from the from the Incredible Hulk movie with Norton. Holy cow! Oh, I just Loki'd him. Heck yeah! Yeah, heck yeah! You know, this is totally gonna be worth buying the game. I swear. Like, like I'm already sold. I, I, I'm enjoying this much a lot. And boom. Haha. <laughs> oh, I was trying to flip the truck. I guess it was only that one time to deal then. That sucks. Whoop. Oh, Hulk, you can jump higher than that, buddy. Whoa! I'm not Spider-Man! <laughs> oh, what? Ah, oh, I thought it would make me repeat that. Oh, I guess it did. Whoop, whoop! Tony, Thor! Got some of those flyers on me! Annoying little guys, aren't they? On my way! Oh, I haven't seen that since the Hulk game. Oh, okay. You know, it would have been hilarious if they gave Hulk his Knuckles' ability to jump. How hilarious would have that been? We got our Gamma Bomb! Yeah! Alright, here we go. Haha! <laughs> Better get out of here. You know, I was thinking today was gonna be one fan clubs and funnel cakes. Focus, Tony. Oh, snap. You know, it would have been really awesome if they actually had a giant boss fight at the end and they just said, screw it, you're using the Hulk for this. Because I know this is kind of like, oh, we're going to give you a tutorial on how all these guys work. Press L. Thunderclap! Thunderclap! Oh, yep, there went everyone. Where's Big Green? I got eyes on him. Hulk, bring him Hulk in wants smoosh smoosh. Hulk wants snooze snooze! Whoopa! Holy crap. Shit! <laughs> I really thought he was gonna slam the tank! Love it. I really. Ah, uh, don't. Ru oh, okay. I thought Black Widow's gonna ruin the fun. Hey, those weapons were meant for the good guys. Is that supposed to be a joke? Not the time. Get your heads in the game. Uh, dysfunctional family. Yeah, Sometimes that's what the Not Avengers sure are that. missing in the movie. Seems like the reactor's malfunctioning. I'm getting strange readings on the monitors. Like we're being pulled to a heat sink. Wow, signal. they always get somebody to sound like a 1940s hero. For real. For Captain America. I would like to go to an alternate universe where the actors for DC and Marvel are switched so Henry Cavill could play Captain America and then we actually get a Ben Affleck uh, Tony Stark. Oh snap, we're about to play as Cap. Steve. Oh! Oh! Oh, is he gonna get all the tactical takedowns? Holy crap! They 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 gave uh, Captain America the Batman's uh, built stuff. Okay, so his and so his uh, body armor looks a lot better in this one. Hold R two to block. I mean, what else could you do with a shield? <laughs> shield. Stars and stripes. <laughs> At that point, it was no point. <laughs> oh. Oh, wow. Way to go, Cap.
You know, that's probably the better way of doing it. Heck yeah! I need an update. The reactor won't stabilize. The turret's molecular structure is breaking down it into a gas. Something below is feeding energy into the reactor. We are the it's ultimate fighting team. Brought together by shield leader Nick Fury. We got us. I'll get back to you. Oh, ouch, that had to hurt. I'm trying, I... Heck yeah. Brooklyn's Brawler. Man, they just gave everyone AoEs for this game. At least the other people made sense. You're telling me Captain America is so strong he can create a shockwave with the vibranium? I do gotta say though, his uh, his armor looks so much better here. The other one, he looked like a tactical police military police officer. Uh oh, oh no! I know what's gonna happen. Sonic bomb? Are you kidding me? Thought the UN outlawed those years ago. Let's have a look, shall we? Uh oh. So that I'm pretty sure that we just well, witnessed uh, Miss uh, Sienna Khan or whatever her name. No, it's not Sienna Khan. Camilla Khan? I can't remember her name. I think we just witnessed uh, um, Miss Marvel about to experience. Oh, it's Taskmaster. Taskmaster. I think they just gave away Black Widow's villain. So, anyways, uh, pretty sure that they, we just witnessed Terror Genesis happening to Camilla Khan. Are we about to play as Black Widow because Taskmaster showed up? Oh, way to go, Hulk. Way to go. Show them what the agents of Smash can do. Alright. That's not fair. That's not fair. The game knows it. Ouch, that had to hurt. Raise up the bridge is secure. <laughs> Natasha should have fed Taskmaster to, to her boyfriend. That's what I would call. If I was dating the She-Hulk, that's what I would have done. I'd been like, here you go, baby. Crush him for me. Thanks, you're a doll. So I'm pretty sure they just gave away the movie's ending. Just saying. Right there. We, we just saw the climactic battle. I don't need to go watch the Black Widow movie anymore. That's it right there. Okay, this isn't too bad. That's all I had to do. Wow. I like to point out I'm not killing a human being, am I? I like to point out I've never played this, so if it looks like I was doing really well for my first time, that's because I was. But you know, once you play one hack and one marble hack and slash, you played all the marble hack and slashes. Ah, Taskmaster, I thought you were going to go toe-to-toe. -to -toe. It also doesn't help that she, they give away their radius when they do that, so 
I'm also playing on normal mode. I'm pretty sure at higher difficulty. Oh, that was a perfect dodge. So it's. It seems like I'm playing as black as a Catwoman now from the Mark from the other games. Okay. Grapple the counterattack or blue yellow. Okay. Must be frustrating. Always one step behind. You're after the chimera, aren't you? What are you gonna do with it? Here's no way I can't be Perry. Did you just Captain America me? Not fair. <laughs> they really kind of made... Oh. Taskmaster was much more fun in the Spider-Man game. Still trying to piece it together? Are you giving up? Not a kill! Where is your investigation okay. left? Okay. You the brains behind this. And this smells like distraction. I'm done talking. Activate Veil of Shadows? Coward. What's the matter? I don't like surprises? Okay, here we go. Next Classic time, martial arts takedown. Take oh, notes. snap. Widow Sting. <laughs> Like I said, I'm pretty pretty sure this is the ending to to Avenge what's it called? To Black Widow's that movie. Coming, huh? You think you've won? What the hell are you talking about? Look around, Romanoff. The world will remember this day. The day their heroes failed them. <laughs> and they chose Avengers Day to do it. What's happening here? <laughs> The city's collapsing. The city's collapsing. Damn it, they played us. Steve, can you hear me? Get the hell out of there. Screw this. No, Iron Man. Thor. What happened to Avengers Assemble? Go, oh, Captain America. He was so young. Hey, Camilla Khan. I mean, I, I would like to point out I could have sworn I saw her with a bald head earlier. Dangerous, untested technology causing damage on an unprecedented scale. Our beloved Captain America was killed during the attempted theft of this technology. Thousands of other innocent people died. Attempted theft, and remember that. Yeah, the they weren't successful. Come to be known as A Day. Hundreds fell sick, encased in strange cocoons, only to emerge with dangerous, otherworldly powers. In, in humans. With no known cure, the disease has spread across the country, and while both S.H.I.E.L.D. and the Avengers promised to rectify the situation, it was Dr. Banner's testimony that brought about the end of an era. You so-called heroes transformed San Francisco into an infectious, gas-filled quarantine zone. You unleashed disease, powerful beings that wreak havoc throughout our nation. Many still Just so you know, this gas alive. does kill regular people. So I ask you again, Dr. Banner, do the Avengers pose a danger to society? Yes. Bruce, Your you coward! Outlawed, the once mighty heroes disbanded. But out of tragedy is born hope. After the government liquidation of Stark Industries, Dr. George Tarleton, himself a victim of A Day and founder of Advanced Idea Mechanics, thinks oh, science there it is. is the solution to our He nation's aimed problems. for this to happen. I wish I knew what happened to Captain Rogers that day, but I was nowhere near the reactor room. 
I don't have those answers, but I, I do like to point out though that they decided to kind of mimic the uh to make the what did you call it the they mimic the Marvel Cinematic Universe as in these heroes don't actually have um, uh, secret identities. And if I'm correct, this has this will have nothing to do with Spider-Man. Tony stashed most of his stuff here when Stark Industries went under. And if anyone knows where Tony is, it's Jarvis. This trail should take us to the Archive's secret entrance. Cool. Well... Nice Kamala. Okay, there we go. Kamala. Yeah, Come on. That's the spirit. Yeah, are you wearing that communications bud I gave you? Yeah, practically invisible. So why did you go back to the Chimera? Well, I didn't. Wow. So did he scare away the resistance? You know, at least they're doing uh, I, in, what's it called? Uh, gameplay cutscenes. At least that's sure something that's always that. new, that's always new and interesting, I guess. Explore the world while they talk. Right. Not like they're, they're the first game to do it, and they probably won't be the last. I, I won't lie, though. I think for a game like this, it probably doesn't work so much, just because, <laughs> well, <laughs> people are used to seeing a yeah, Marvel Avengers uh, Avengers movie, so I don't think they would have minded cutscenes. Let me help. Thanks. So I think pretty sure Captain Marvel's a thing There's just a because just ahead, she wears Miss Marvel's old there. shirt. Cool. <laughs> so what does Jarvis but I'm really glad they didn't put Captain Marvel in it, just Miss Marvel. Because, you know, they're introducing Inhumans into this universe. And Captain Marvel, oh my gosh, she'd be OP for this game, you know? Like, she was too OP for the Avengers. I'm also liking the fact that this, uh, that Banner's wearing a purple shirt instead of purple pants. And that dude messed up. Doctor Banner, what do I do? What? And I don't think quick time events for the Hulk is necessary just because, you know, he's the freaking Hulk. Rage. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that if they're using comic book Thor, I I'm pretty or Hulk. I mean, I'm pretty sure that the that these guys wouldn't even stand a chance. Like, there's no quick time events for this, people. I'm sorry. I'm 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 very happy that there's a game out there where I can Loki. Uh, robots or villains in general. This is bad. Crap. Surrender quietly. You have been. He's crawling all over the place. I get here so fast. You know what? That's it. I'm riding out. I like to point out I'm doing Marvel vs. Capcom moves right now. Get out of the way, get out of the way, get out of the way. I swear, it's like somebody else is on the other end controlling these characters, and they're like, get out of the way, get out of the way, get out of the way. Why is not my dodge button not working? I like that everybody has like their own uh, L2 aim, and they just gave the Hulk, oh, I'm just going to pick up some debris or bolt. I'm just going to pull a boulder out of here.
Come on, Kamali. It's been a while for you, but come on. You're gonna tell me I can't play as Canola Kong here in. Ah. Uh, how? I think I just remembered I had Thunderclap. I uh, like that she had. Yeah, they had to give her some kind of weapon. Aw, oh, snap. And the fact that they gave him grenade, a grenade style thing. Leave me alone. Hulk smash. Hulk bash. Hulk the strongest there is. No, you're not. The Hulk said, I'm hit. The returning to base. Nope, I'm hit. Now I'm gone. I hope that was. A change of clothes. I like the fact that his sleeves are still on him, and he's using them, and they look like hand wraps. Leave tall buildings in a single bound. Oh, I guess we're going this way. Nope, I don't think that was the right way. Anyways, somewhere is the right way. Uh, I played any, if you play any kind of game, yeah. I like to point out that Hulk can actually travel the world being what's called sky bounding like this. Oh, I can tell by your silence that you are not amused. That's okay. I don't think Bruce likes my jokes either. No, Bruce. Okay, okay. I won't mention the uh. Oh, uh, there we go. The glasses. <laughs> Wall jumping. Okay. Hokey want snoo snoo. Hokey gets snoo snoo. Stupid wall. What does that do? I like how Hulk just kicks open that tre. Yep, he he just kicked open that tre that book. Uru, interesting. Lightweight quake simulator gear. Wow. Okay. Ha <laughs> ha! Watch out! There we go. Hulk smash! I'm not gonna lie, I'm having very fun just doing destructive things with a Hulk. And that's the thing, it has to be mindless. Which isn't a bad thing either. What? Oh crap, you're right. This doesn't look temporary. I like the Hulk. You're right. I think I can hear you. Yay. Hey. Uh, we good? Okay. We're cool. I guess. Oh, so that's where Camilla went. We didn't just arrive. They've set up shop. We've got to find Jarvis and get out of here. 
You know what? Eh. Just because Hulk can't regularly punch these. That's the problem with video games when they try to make overpowered characters. They have to underpower them. I guess it's okay. As long as the game's fun, am I right? But I remember when they did the Incredible Hulk game. Oh my gosh, you could actually take down buildings. You could leap across New York. You can leap across New York. Like right across Manhattan. It put Spider-Man's, uh... Sp what's it called? Slingshot thing. I could head through the vents and yeah. What's it called? Put the shame. Oh man. What if we kill Hydra Bob? Oh wait, this is me. My bad. Uh, you distract them. I'll find a way in. Oh, for a second. Oh, you live. How do you it live from that? Did you just hurt yourself? Might like, see, look. Idea. How do you live from that? He just threw a boulder at people. Crap. They're closing it all down. I'm in. These vents are huge. Looks like Ian built around the original archive. Everything's new. Okay, that's it. Nope. There we go. Yeah, we did it. Leave me alone! Thunderclap! And there went that poor sap. I know what you're thinking. I probably could just jump up there and just smash the guy myself. Ah, screw it. I was having my fun, and then these guys have to exist. Big group of guys headed for the elevator. There we go. How dare you! How dare you! And oh great! Now I got a rock, and I have no idea what to do with it. Are those guys purple Spartans? Oh my gosh! They actually made the aim people look like Spartans yeah, instead of just wearing regular hazmat suits. Ow! <laughs> His dodge. Hey, what you? I'm like a gorilla. All right, what do we got here? Nope. Okay, that's it. It's like, I got a rock, I'm not afraid to use it. Of course, oh! I like how they get the, like, let's get a bigger robot. And let's see if we can do anything about it. Okay, I ain't got no more things to smash, so I'm just gonna take the Sentinel and just... You know, it says Sentinel. I wonder if it has anything to do with the X-Men. And it's going to probably be Advanced Idea Mechanics' fault for the fact that these creatures exist. Those are the ones that killed the, uh... The original archive must be deeper inside the building. I'll keep Actually, looking. now I think about it, how crazy would it be? It... Yeah, how crazy would it be... It, what's called, if they had an Avengers vs. the X-Men game, and they actually gave, had a Hulk level where he fought nothing but Sentinels, and those Sentinels were like, holy crap, we can't fight the Hulk. We're all gonna die. Yeah. We are the ultimate fighting team. Oh. You know what, buddy? Let's see how you like when I Loki your friends. How do you like that, huh? How do you like that? Okay, so if I gotta activate my rage. 
Wow, killed off by a mine. Or a grenade. Whichever it was. My question is, Camilla, why haven't you done anything, huh? Why have you not done anything? Why are you even here? You see, you have more power than Captain America, and at least he can do something. And to, and to put make this into a thing, freaking Captain, freaking uh. Okay. And just to put this into perspective, at least Captain America can actually fight off Spider-Man. And the Hulk if he wanted to. I understand that, but I'm holding somebody. Man, they really just didn't want me to have. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, no! Yeah, if I was playing Marvel vs. Capcom, that's the move I'm spanning for the Hulk. No quarter circles needed for this game. Wow, that didn't do uh, the damage I wanted it to do. I know it says find the Olympia, but to kind of give you an idea, I don't think Hulk wants to find, it doesn't have the patience for that. Whoopa! Oh, I get it now. Damn it! Alright, that's it. All right, now we got in it. Open the gear screen. Oh, finally. Press it to heighten the gear menu. I mean, I'm just trying to do gear stuff and I can't even find the cursor. It says units, current, credits. Okay, so can I now select my gear? Okay. What just happened? Okay, there we go. That's better. Okay, I like to point out that this is weird. So I feel like this is actually meant for a PC because that cursor exists. Let's go to melee gear. Can we boost it? It looks like we can. Dr. Banner. No banner, only Hulk. They're keeping something on the top floor. Meet me there. It might be the archive. I know it said to smash the door, but I can't seem to find the door. What's that say? You might get okay. No, you're dead. That's the first floor. I don't think they know I'm here. Doctor, I know you can hear me. Please, you can fight him. I wonder. I wonder if this is the part. I wonder if Tarleton's gonna be the one that becomes uh, Modok. Or he creates Modok. I wonder how they're going to do Modok in this game. That's the thing that mo most modern Avengers things they don't really do Modok anymore. Like I understand he was a he was not a big like he's a big villain. Like people know who Modok is, but he was like a uh, Mandarin's uh, henchman. I wonder if they're going to give us villains here that haven't appeared in the movies yet. I guess Taskmaster technically counts because Black Widow, but if you go by the original release date for both the game and the movie. Taskmaster would have already oh oh 
would have already been a thing. A mighty Thor, and this is war. You see my hammer better run for the door. A heart of steel with sex appeal. Let's say reinforcements and bounty administration. That's the first floor. No, Bella. I don't think they know Only Hulk. Hulk. I know you can hear me. Please. You can fight him. Nah, puny I god. Puny robot. Wait, Hulk has a takedown? No, guys, like, think, ladies and gentlemen, think about that for a second. Hulk has a takedown. And they have only seen the takedowns done with the uh, heroes that actually use martial arts and don't have superpowers. Well, I guess Captain America does technically have superpowers. But think about that for a sec. You're sitting here. Yeah, there we go, Hulk. You're sitting here going, oh, hey, I'm going to use a takedown with the Hulk. Like, what kind of takedown does the Hulk do? His fist is the takedown. See, look. I don't even know where I was aiming with that. I really don't. Okay. You know what? Let's play some Pokemon, guys. Geodude, I choose you. Rock Smash. Are you trying to take down the Hulk? Stranglehold ready. Ooh. There's a path up through the research lab. You have to bust through the server room. This isn't you. This wow, they really think that you. stairs are gonna stop the Hulk. This research destroyed. You need to. And bye. I don't think these guys ever actually seen uh, footage of how the U.S. Army failed to capture the Hulk on several occasions. I like to point that out. You dare challenge that? Ouch. I was not expecting to fall off the way I did. Nah. You jerk, you won't give me this time. Distracted you with my rock throw. Ah! Yeah, destroy everything. Looks like I'm good here. Whoop whoop. I can help you. Yeah, right. Okay, that's it. Was that a waste? Probably. There we go. Let's introduce them. To my fist, Betty and Ross.
Yeah, screw it. Did it work? Did I destroy everything in sight? That's what I assumed all these Hulk missions were about. Let me help you, Bruce. Again, the stairs is not the issue. The issue is there is a giant hulking man going around and smashing everything. And uh, some genius goes, hey, I have an idea. Let's get rid of the stairs. No, you're not ready for that. That's it. Oh, come on. Ugh. Come on, me. Don't suck. Beat him into the corner. Huh. Just like boxing. For those that don't know, I've taken boxing classes. I'm a pretty awesome person. I'm pretty awesome when it comes to working that corner. So are we ignoring the fact that he just picked up a piece of the ground and the ground regenerated? Yeah, we're ignoring that? Okay, I won't bring it up again unless I feel like it. And... I'm in something called a... Terragenesis lab? What is this? Oh no. Oh, is this how Camilla's gonna get her powers? Again, why are you even you there? If you're not helping with all the fighting. Keeping the in here. At least let me play as Kamala. This is where they hurt them. Hulk. So I like I the fact you. that we actually got to play to almost nearly a full destroy. hour of this game. Smash! Restrain the Hulk! You saw the truth. Ha! Banner. Restrain the Hulk! You, you are funny! But you know what, though? I have to admit the, the fact that we're actually getting an expert on fighting giant monsters, and that is Sigourney Weaver's robot. But the problem is, you don't really have a Sigourney Weaver, do you? He's lying. He's not saving anyone. I wish I didn't have to come to this. Oh, yeah? Well, buddy, Hulk is the strongest there is. And let me tell you, Hulk will smash. I can see you fighting him. You don't want to be this thing. But you're weak. Both of you. Eat it. Eat it. Beat it. Beat it. You know my bad, I'm bad. You know, you know. You know, I'm not gonna lie, I've been playing Hulk for so long, I totally forgot this was an Avengers game. Not gonna lie. Hulk stash! Hulk has the mightiest stash there is! Destroy everything! What is up, Rojo Mage? Hey man, I hope you're enjoying the show, watching me suck! The game's really fun, I gotta admit that. Like, I was expecting not to like this game because most uh, superhero games like, they depower the, the character so much it becomes unfun, but at the same time you have to, so that way you could have this Hulk actually being able to die. And that's why very few heroes could actually pull off a hack and slash game like this. An example would be like Batman and uh, Iron Man to a certain extent. I had fun with his t movie tie-in game. Yeah, you did fall into that trap. <laughs> Anyways, yeah. 
one of the things is that Spider-Man and Batman make the best games because you can you don't have to nerf the character so much that it becomes unfun. Spider-Man's personality nerfs himself. And then they, and then they have like moves like this for the Hulk. Yeah. And then on top of that, like with and then Batman doesn't even need it. Well, Batman has a skill tree. Uh, Kev did not tell me the news. What was the news? I don't know, because Kev I haven't talked to Kev in a while. He's told me a lot of things since then, so could you tell me the news and what's going on? Oh, snap. Hold on. I'm fighting Sigourney Reaver robots. You know what? Drango! Oh my gosh, that's awesome! That is awesome! I can't believe I actually took out the Sigourney Weaver robot like that. Me, him, and two other people are getting together to make a SCP. Oh, snap! Way to go! I'm not gonna lie, I did a lot of S... Before SCP blew up the way it did, I actually watched a lot of SCP videos way back in the day. Like... I, I can't remember. I think I might have been playing Minecraft or some other game that didn't require, let it didn't require my ears to pay attention. I think it was probably Minecraft. So I would actually listen to SCP videos, and there's a lot of good ones out there too. Like uh, there's one. There's like a there's like a uh, SCP that I really like that works like a uh, like the uh, uh, the Weeping Angels you know from uh, Doctor Who. Thing. And people have to go in and clean okay. up. We're using... Oh, okay. I'll have to look those up. So let me see. Let me pause this real quick. I'm going to take a picture of that chat because I do not want to go and... Yeah. Okay, cool. That's awesome, man. Do it. I, I, I would play the crap out of that game. Just saying. Okay, 173. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, I used to watch... I watched a lot of them last summer. And the SCP ones... Oh, man, so great. Um, I, can't, I don't know the numbers off the top of my head, but if I'm correct, you're, you, are y'all using the horn head one? It's like where you got two horns and he makes it sound like anything. Because that one was, was creepy. <laughs> makes the Silent Hill anthem through his horns. But that's really cool, man. Like, um, well, I guess... Yeah, man, I don't mind. If you if you don't mind, also, I would like to stream the game, even if it's like beta stages. Like, um, I just got to get capture equipment for my for a P and a PC. But yeah, I would not mind testing out the game for y'all. Yeah, most definitely, dude. Okay. Ah. Yeah, I got distracted. Yeah, because, like, uh, that, that, that's one of the things that I feel like my channel is lacking is indie horror. Everything I've been doing has been on my PlayStation. So the only horror games I have is Resident Evil 2, 3. I want to do Code Veronica, but at the same time, I'm trying to... Well, actually, I just haven't, I, I just haven't felt like playing Code Veronica. I'm not going to lie. I do want to do Soma when I get play, my PlayStation... Uh, Plus account back. But one of the things I wanted to do was to actually get a uh, a laptop just to play the indie horror games, not not the high end stuff that's going to require me to go or not not a gaming PC that's going to completely, you know, bankrupt me for like two thousand dollars just so I could uh, play all these game all the PC like all the high end PC games. Like if I'm playing Avengers, I'm totally playing this. Okay, awesome. Uh, what's it called? I was actually gonna pl try to uh, try a game called Night Cry. It's uh, a successor to the Clock Tower series. It was uh, basically it, it plays. Uh, I don't know if you're familiar with the Clock Tower series, but I'm pretty sure you watched Kevin play Haunting Ground, and um, that's one of the things that uh, what's called. That's one of the game. Yeah, basically it's uh, a successor to that game. Not, not, yeah, wow, I can't believe I keep losing at this, but I'm also, I also don't care enough <laughs> to actually go, I need to get past this part. Yeah, I don't relatively care enough.
<laughs> but basically, um, yeah, so that's one of the games I want to stream is Nightcrawler. I want to, I want to do a bunch of horror games on the PC whenever I get a chance to, because you know that that's how you make it. That's how you make it in this platform. I can see you fighting him. You don't want to be this thing. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Well, and that's the thing. Like, uh, I don't mind. What's it called? I don't mind playing the like. I feel like every person play can play the same game, but it's always gonna be a different experience for that person. Like, most definitely. Here we go. Ah. Let's do this. I'm gonna do strong attacks because those really mess people up. But yeah, so, dude, totally, do, do your own games too, man, like, I've been experimenting with the channel, like, yes, I, I did this game because I figured it'd be a nice treat for everybody that's a, that likes to play on my channel. I did under, I did the first episode of Undertale, uh, my playthrough of it, where I get to do all the voiceover work on it, and, like, I'm trying not to do all the text box games, but you gotta do Undertale, well, at least for me, for me, I felt like that. That's what I told myself. Like, I had to do Undertale. No, you haven't sent me anything. Just, uh... i just been doing self-promos on the Discord. So, I'm, I'm not sure what you mean by game room. Oh, man. There we go. If you can't stop the Hulk, then I will. I have to. I really don't know what just happened. <laughs> um. No, no! Get out of there! Run! Okay, I guess I'm running away now. <laughs> wow, it's just a big old running sequence. Yeah. So, and uh, I've been experimenting with the channel. I felt like uh, li I live streamed Resident Evil 3, but I didn't enjoy it all that much. It's just because I had got done playing it, I felt like I needed to talk about it, so I went and did it on that channel. Um, I did RE2 as a test run, and then I did Leon as a full campaign. I've been playing a lot of. Oh, I guess I'm playing as Camilla now. Okay, cool. Yay. I'm going to try to get it open, okay? In Big In! I guess. <laughs> oh, they should have done. They should have. They should have done her like Spider-Man. Wow, she can jump. That girl can jump. I was not expecting to do have that happen. So, anyways, I'd like to point out though is that uh, let me see. Okay, cool. Uh oh. So okay, she's a lot weaker than the Hulk. So yeah, I'm feeling. <laughs> so yeah, I, I saw it over. I saw it over. Yeah, I'm not. I'm not. Yeah, I'm trying not to like answer text messages while I'm on stream, just because I don't want dead air or something like. Oh, he's not playing anymore. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah. So, anyways, I only I only do answer direct messages if that's someone's like formal way of communicating with me. Like I have people who ha who use direct messages because the keyboard's so far away. And if she ever does get around to watching this video, yes, I am talking about you, Renee. <laughs> oh, I did a perfect dodge. That was pretty dope. Okay, I like I love her range. I like playing as Camilla Khan right now. That's pretty dope range. Okay, woo. Yeah, I'll check it later. Definitely, man. Thanks for coming over and supporting the channel. Um, yeah, I also did Minecraft. Basically, I'm just screwing around on Minecraft, just getting my bearings in it. I died like twice in my like, stream. I don't think I streamed like an hour and a half. But yeah, I, I did it because I yeah I try to keep my stream like two and a half hours. But like, say if I'm playing multiple games, I try to uh, get as much gameplay as I like. For example, uh, when I finished RE2. 
That's awesome, man. Having an afternoon off. Yeah, I, I like. I, I'll play in the afternoons when it's my day off. Cause I got a, I got a fan in the UK that's all about. Hey, I want to, I want to watch your channel. And I'll do stuff for him. And then at nighttime he'll show up. It depends because like, we don't always have like the best. Uh... Guess I've got to keep flipping switches oh, okay. to get the power on. <laughs> Anyways, I'm digressing. But yeah. Um. Ooh, what's going on? Oh, okay, it's a, it's a chest. Na 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 na. Okay. So I guess I got that turned on. Yeah, it doesn't give me an indicator where to go on the map now. Right, the switches. Get on it, come on. Oh, okay, I get it. I guess. Yeah, here we go. So, anyways, um, uh, we. So yeah, I try. So I try to get as much streaming as I can, but I'm also trying not to become a slave to it, so I don't end up hating myself for it. So I take breaks and days off. And then I try not to do anything like too high end. For example, I, I think I would be I, I would be miserable if I did Persona 5. I don't know if Marcus told you uh, or Kevin, but I'm playing Persona 5 now, but with Chloe around. And so, like, I'm not playing a lot of Persona 5 because I have to play when Chloe's around, and she doesn't always feel like watching me play Persona 5. But that's okay though. It allows me to play other games too. So like, I finished Dragon Quest 2 and I'm now playing Dragon Quest 3. Which is a lot of fun, but it's completely different from the from the first two Dragon Quests. Where the first one you only played as one character. And this... Oh! I was, I was not expecting that. That's actually pretty dope. I need to work on the range of that. So, yeah. Oop. Okay, uh, she... Okay, so... So far, the only takedowns I've had have been her, Captain America, Black Widow, I guess the whole... Wait, wait. Oh, I'm not, like... Yeah, like, uh... I... Th what's called? I'm at the... I'm actually at the part... I'm still doing, uh, Kamoshida's, uh... I'm, I'm infiltrating Kamoshida's, uh, palace. But I'm, like, right where... I'm, like, right at the, uh, beginning, though. Like, for example, um... I'm probably in the first ten hours of the game. Pretty much. So... Yeah, I'm at the part where they all decide we're going to be Phantom Thieves. Stop messing around, Kamala. So, yeah. Some switches. But I, I do have to say, I'm having a lot of fun with it. But the problem is that, and I explained this to Chloe and my brothers, I played about 10 hours of the game, and I'm going to say about 2 hours of that is combat. And then the rest of the eight hours have been, uh, or at least the first ten hours is like actually like part of it was like combat or something. There's like yeah, one hour's combat, and then I forgot I played like three more hours of it the other night, and it was probably like maybe the entire time we've been doing combat, and it's like two hours. And then on top of that, like the experience ratings and stuff, like you can level grind, but it's not a lot of experience for Kamoshida's uh, area yet. <laughs> Ooh, what's this do? In big in. Okay, now that's just awesome. Yeah. Other than that, for after I got Persona and played it, I actually played the Digimon Cyber Sleuth series, which is basically if uh, Digimon and um, Persona Four had a baby. Yeah, like the style, like the style and the concept of it is like the Persona games. Okay, and then it's like Pokemon battles if it was all triple battle. Oh, that's cool. Okay, so yeah, I go through here now. Please be here, Jarvis. Maybe he's hiding somewhere in this super cool pile of Avenger stuff. Ah. Uh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Marcus was telling me that. 
uh, I was telling Chloe, it's kind of sad that the game was 12 hours long and we're still in the tutorial. And, yeah. Oh, well, that's the thing. Like, I'm pretty sure Kev you've heard Kevin say this before. And I have heard Kevin say this before. But I'm not actually quoting him because I'm pretty sure he got it from me at some point. But basically, it's, uh... Here, here's how I put it. Um, if I wanted to play, if I wanted to watch an anime, I would watch an anime. And if I wanted to, uh, play, uh, if I want, what's it called, if I want to play a video game, I would play a video game. I told him RPGs are not the same as they were some odd years ago. Like, uh, basically, hey, I found, or was it, was it, um, most RPGs usually give you a stick, a pot here. lid, and pin $20 on your collar and wish you the best of luck. And basically you found the story on the way. Now you have to go through all these cutscenes just before you even get to the gameplay. Oh, like it's been, yeah, yeah. And the battle at it isn't railroad, nope, level, yeah. Yeah, and that's the thing. Like, Marcus says, you have to beat the game. You have to beat certain things at a certain time and limit and day. Because you have that calendar system. Like, there's a certain point that you, you only have so much amount of time to complete your objective. Which is pretty awesome, but it does not leave enough time for let's level grind. Jarvis. Let's try to get uh, as much as we can into the... Into the uh, or try to get as much as you can out of this place until we can't level grind anymore. Like, what was it? Final Fantasy XV, you probably went through a lot of cutscenes before you were able to free roam. Is that the Abomination? It's the Abomination. Why don't you let me have that? Oh my gosh, they made him look like a mix between the movie and the comics. Disappointing. I wonder if we get a fight. Oh, no, there's a Hulk. We may not get. Oh, wait, I think we are going to fight him because we follow the Hulk down. Oh wow. All units, find the girl and stay out of my way. There's something wrong with you. Probation daddy. Alright, I'll That's something I'll uh think uh that's something I'll definitely do, bud. I like that abomination so much bigger than the Hulk. Oh, is it? That's cool. I can do that too, motherfucker. Ooh, I said a swear word in, on YouTube. I hope I don't get demonetized. Okay, that's annoying. Now that's just annoying. Okay, so I like to point out that we're supposed to think Captain America's dead. Even the promotional says, no, he's dead. You're not playing as Captain America. Yet the loading screen says otherwise. Like... I like to point this out. If you want your people to think your character is dead, don't show him in the promotional material or in the loading screens. Like, like seriously. Like, how crazy would it have been if no, if we uh, had like a post-apocalyptic Avengers moment, and everyone's like, the Avengers are dead, or something, someone's dead. And like, with the way the trailer did it is fine, but at the same time, they chose Captain America to be the one that's dead. Like, you want to know who I would believe was dead after that event? Hawkeye, Black Widow, not Captain America. Heck, Captain America can't even die of old age.
It's not just, it, it can be good writing. Look, 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 it can be good writing. But here's the thing about good writing. It doesn't, you can make it, you can make the best story ever, but if the promotional team spoils something of it, then everyone is going to not like that material. But I'm pretty sure, but like, uh, but I'm pretty sure though, like, I wouldn't be surprised if Square Enix goes, oh no, 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 he, he's dead. We just wanted to make you think he was alive. And again, like, it wouldn't surprise me if that was the case. Because it's Square Enix. Like, if you ever played any of the Dissidia games, which probably prompted people to go check out a lot of their other games, like, oh, hey, yeah, we got, like, dude, we have, like, 12 different Final Fantasies. I'm sorry you've only ever played, like, 7 and 10. So. Oh. So, like, a, so a bunch of it is that, uh... Like, because of the Dissidia games, I honestly thought that they gave Cecil a transformation in the game that allowed him to go back between... to job change between Paladin and Dark Knight. But if you play the real game, nuh -uh, it's it's permanent. It's perma. It's very permanent in the games. But you don't also realize how many people actually die in that game. And that's the thing, you never actually see it coming, too. Like, there are some points where it does, but you can't expect it to be that player forever. And then there's just some moments where you're just like, what? So yeah, like, old Square Enix did really good writing, but... Yeah, that's right, that's what happened. MODOK hired Genesis and Sephiroth. This is a precursor to Final Fantasy VII. Yeah, that's right, our favorite characters got uh, isekai into this game. Because Square Enix. I actually wouldn't be surprised if Batman showed up. Sure, Rocksteady had a lot to do with bat with the Batman thing, but Square Enix was associated with it. I, again, I would not be surprised if they put Batman in here. You can't put Batman in a Marvel game. Yeah, well, Square Enix can. They'll figure it out. They always figure it out. Oh, snap. Here we go. Hulk smash. Before, before crisis. Yep. That's exactly how it happened. Oh, snap. It, it's also kind of funny that, uh... Um... That Crisis on Infinite Earths was supposed to be the one thing where they said, Okay, no more multiverse. Only to break the rules. I swear, DC... Probably one of the biggest rule breakers out there. But then again, I think all comic book distribu uh, distributors are. And there's a lot of people that break these their own rules that they set in their own universe. Hulk catches the energy sphere. Hulk pounds it with abomination. Love it. I think Hulk's trying to tell him to shut up. Wow. Wow. Way to go. Okay, so I like to point out this is The Last of Us 3, Joel's Revenge. Joel survived because he was able to Hulk out. And now, he, uh, now uh, what's called Ellie's wife, oh, yeah. turns out the twist of plot is she's Kamala Khan, and she is now an inhuman. Right. And, what's so. called, and now Ellie is home taking care of the child. This is what happens whenever you upset uh, Joel after killing him. Show me your secrets. You have your secret. What's going on? I like the thing. It's also hilarious is the fact that uh, Jarvis is always going to be seen as a robot thing, as a robot, just because of that uh, movies. 
Dark Terrigen. Oh, snap. That's not good. They're creating evil in humans. Oh, well, I think they figured out how to kill in humans. Wow. That, okay, I like to point out that Marvel is likes to kill their inhumans. I don't know what is up with that. Seriously. Okay, I guess in this case, uh, they cured him. But seriously, what is up with Marvel doing that? Like, they try to make, they try to make, they couldn't get the mutants, right? They could not get the X-Men. So they tried to turn inhumans into the new X-Men. And it went to the, it crashed to the ground. Banner, where did you come from? Where did your glasses come from? Get out of here. It isn't safe. Where did you get the jacket? Yeah. What did you have, like, why didn't you say the Hulk? Were you that desperate to get out? Come on. Uh, well, Where did you get your clothes? I, get more... I don't understand any of this. Her, there is no way that her bag is big enough to to hold an extra set of clothes, just in case he hulks out. Where is okay. this? No. Okay. There are problems I have with this. <laughs> yeah. He was wearing a jacket. Now he's not wearing a jacket. It's real. Sorry, what was that? Um, uh, unless this is like, a, unless there was like a time skip I'm not aware of. It's real. I mean. And now he's uh. What was it? there's a time skip I'm not aware of, and they're back at base, but I uh, but as far as I know, since uh, what I've been paying attention to, like they're still at the aim at the aim headquarters or one of their facilities. It looks like it really hurts, but maybe that's worth it. Maybe? But I think it would be cool as if uh, I'm surprised they also didn't do Professor Hulk. I mean, but then again, I don't think the Vin oh no, in game was out when this when the trailer for this I dropped. Never mind. And that's why Square Enix is trying to capitalize on the Avengers game and Spider Man. Remember, Spider Man was a thing. So it's interesting that they're having this game not connect to the Spider Man game at all, and I appreciate that. I really do. Just because if this game failed, then it's like, oh, well, I guess it's not going to connect to Spider-Man, and Spider-Man won't be an Avenger. So Spider-Man, should his next game should start the new Avengers, starring him and Miles Morales. Logan, playing as the Wolverine, the Thing, uh, Iron Fist, and uh, Power Man with War Machine. And, it will, and then they'll be titled... We'll show Square how to make a real Avengers game. With the new Avengers. It's um, thank now, that you. would be a game worth playing, playing very right very there. Okay. Look at it. I gotta say that this, this is what's called. I've been enjoying myself playing this game, but I won't lie, it got a little, it got quite repetitive. I think I like the idea, though, that I was actually playing as, a, what's it called, as the different Avengers throughout the fights. So it was pretty awesome to do that. Okay, so they there was a time skip, and they actually went back to the base. Alright, so let's see. Alright, I think I'll go ahead and cut the stream right here. That was a lot of fun. Um... Yeah, but other than that, like, this, th so far we've had about over an hour of content right now. Which is actually probably a lot more than what most games do. I do remember that the RE2 demo had, gave you two hours of gameplay, but you could compete the, complete the first part in 20 minutes or less. So people try to make the most out of that demo. Um, so it's pretty interesting on the fact that we have this. But I'm going to go ahead and cut today's stream. Thanks everyone for joining. Um, we had a lot of fun today, so y'all take care and goodbye.